Welcome back. I usually film my intros Friday night. It's Saturday morning. I'm in a rush, but don't worry, because it means you get to hear me babble on less, which is fantastic. But here's me still babbling on, so... Uh... Hi all, welcome back to a new video on the channel. Hope you're all doing well. Today we're off to watch some National League South Football watching Farnborough. They are taking on the mighty Dartford FC, who are hoping to get their first points with Tony Berman in charge. This game, very quickly, is as close as it comes. These two teams are literally next to each other, one place apart in the table. Two points to be precise, Farmer on 36, Dartford on 34. And if these two teams don't want to get sucked into that relegation battle, I think picking up some points today is imperative. I think the two biggest things to take into consideration with these two sides is recent form is shocking for both. Both haven't won in their last four. I'll put Farnborough's recent form on screen. They're four losses straight in the league at the moment, which is really poor for them. But the thing to remember about them is at home they are a great side and they've only lost twice all season at home. Dartford, on the other hand, we have managed to pick up two points out of our last four, although they were really disappointing draws where we conceded really late to chuck away all three points. The loss against Weymouth last weekend was extremely, extremely disappointing in my opinion, but today is a fantastic chance to bounce back and get some points on the table. So let's hope we can do it against the Farnborough side, who are really out of form. If there's any chance to beat them away, it's today. Anyway, got a two-hour drive. Let's meet the Dartford boys. See you there. The boys are back, it's Dartford away, we've been waiting, they've travelled to Truro, didn't happen, Bath got cancelled, finally an away day, it's predictions time, I've done mine, nice simple 1-1 one, one draw, we'll go to Dad first because uh, I don't think we're going to like this Darts fans. No, I'm afraid I'm talking with my head and not my heart today, I think it's going to be 3-1 to Farnborough and unfortunately I think Harvey Bradbury's going to score two against uh, us today. Heartbreaking. Ooh. Look at this guy in the back. What are you saying? Um, to be honest, I, we're in absolute turmoil at the moment. Um, I'm really not liking what I'm seeing. We haven't brought a new centre back in, so um, I'm on the same wavelength as Dad at the moment. Oh, I have said no. I will never predict a Dartford loss. And I won't! 2-1 <laughs> yeah. Dartford! Come on! Come on, the darts! The state of my phone, guys. That's so oh, oh. <laughs> Just bought my dad. One pound thirty-five hula hoops. He's he's dropped some. I'm livid. I'm livid. Sorry, mate. Today it's the white art for some drinks, James. How are you feeling? James, you want to get involved? James, you want a free pint of burger? Come on, mate. Get in. Come on. The boys have arrived. Seven-minute walk away. This guy didn't even want to do a seven-minute walk. It's absolute. Look, there's spices <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> We've walked, yes. We've walked 10 seconds and he's starting about this <laughs> There you go, look. It's a big game. It's a big game. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty pleased with the lineup. I think there's every chance we get three points. Um, come on, you darts. It's a lineup. Uh, new boy is in the lineup that we signed just yesterday. Fantastic to see. Wall and Colson up top. You feeling pleased with the lineup, mate? You know what? I was coming in with a very negative attitude. And after seeing that, I've got my dreams ready to be crushed again. Yeah, so. good lad. Yeah, so. no, good side, good side. Doing it today? We doing it today, mate? I always try and keep a level head before I get in. As soon as I get here, yes, I think we're going to do it. No? We're going to do it, yeah. And Dad thinks it. we're going to do it. No, oh, okay, okay. It's a good turnout as well. Really good turnout. Yeah. So, yeah, excited for it. Come on, you dogs. Yeah, points flowing. It's 10 minutes to kick off. The setup at Farnborough, I must say, the setup at Farnborough is lovely. Stadium behind the goal, nice big stand. Clubhouse, first time me and James are coming here. It's really nice, um, spacious, plenty of places to go and have a beer. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm just buzzing for kickoff now. I think we're going to do it. I'll have to ask my account. We ain't made stone, we ain't made stone, we ain't made stone, we ain't made stone. 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 We ain't made Oh, 
play. Go on. Go on. Oh. Go on, get in. Oh. Go on. Go on. Go on. Yo, oh my God. Come on. Right, it's 41st minute, we haven't talked much, but I'm just going to be honest, Dartford have been quite good, a couple of really good chances, that's an unreal save from the Dartford keeper, got many thoughts on the half so far, 40 minutes gone? Very level game, very level game, looks like a 1-0 game to be honest. So... I think my 1-1 actually might be about right. Yeah, hopefully, looks like Farnborough is starting to put on the pressure at the end of the game, so hopefully we go in 0-0 or Nick 1 would be 0-0 would be ideal, yeah. 0-0 uh, is a fair reflection at the moment. But and they've got a corner. Three minutes left, they've got a corner. It's half time, it's nil nil. It's been a very, very, very equal half. Place is looking lovely, enjoying another pint at half time, ready for the second half. Hopefully, three points may just come our way. Just quickly, James and Dad, any thoughts on that? Um, it was quite dull, to be honest. Anyone else? <laughs> Yeah, quite, it's quite, quite dull. A, quite dull first half. It looks like a very even couple of teams. Dartford look comfortable. Um, they look I'm comfortable. still not hopeful. I, no, I think it looks like two teams that should be nowhere near where they are. No, if no, I'm being honest. Be higher. And it's nice to see Dartford playing football for once instead of pumping it up the yeah. pitch. So I don't know. I've got a bit of hope. I think we can nick one, but it'd be nice to see a bit more from Alex Wall itself. I think for me personally, if anyone's going to win, it's going to be a really narrow 1-0 win. But time will tell, there's 45 minutes to go. All I can say is... Yeah, man! You don't! Watch your pain. Watch it. Watch it. I didn't realise. Uh huh? <laughs> <laughs> It took about three minutes and uh, Farnborough got a penalty. What do you think, mate? Do you think it was? I couldn't really see it. I'd be lying I if I said I, I knew. I couldn't see it, but it don't matter. It's, it's on the cards. It's just uh, Dartford all over, in it? That's just put our faith in the keeper and that's hope. And there you go, 50 minutes, uh, dart for one nil down, penalty. Come on! Come on! Come on, lads, would you believe it? Managed to get one back, did you expect that? No. Oh. Oh, did, you, no. did you expect the? Did you expect to get a goal back that quickly? Oh, cool. The minute we went one 0 down, I it thought was, that was curtains. Mate. But Tyrell Miller Rodney, good goal as well. It Nicely played goal. in, Brilliant back goal. stick. James Brilliant is not happy with the decision there to call it offside. No, mate, it are, wasn't you, off. are you happy with the goal though? Yeah, fine. <laughs> da, 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 da. Miller Rodney. Get in! Get in! Oh. Oh, go on. Unlucky. Go on. Oh, oh me. Yeah, the black. Go on. Go on. Go on. Go on. Oh. Black. Oh, me. I just said it for the 57th thousand time. How, How did, that... did that not go in? That is crazy. How did that didn't go in? It's because it hit the post. <laughs> Look. 
first side to 2-1. Apparently their keeper, their own keeper has just said it's offside. All the Dartford players think it was offside. The Lino and referee have had a chat. Don't look like it's going to be disallowed. It's 2-1 Farnborough with 12 minutes to go. Oh, are we entering relegation zone? It's bad, mate. It's bad. It's what I suspected, and it is bad. We won't get relegated, but it could be a very horrible rest of the season. Farnborough 2, Dart for 1. Go on. Oh my god. What a sight. Go on, go on. Oh my god, what the fuck is that? Five minutes at a time, mate. You got any hope at all for a goal in at a time? No, 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 absolutely no. If anything, a... usually we concede this time. Yeah, we're in a we're in a relegation battle. I'm sorry, but that's what we're in. I know you don't like to hear it, mate, but we're in a relegation battle. It's uh, another poor day at the office against a side that are way out of form. <coughs> Five minutes left to get a goal back. I don't think it's going to happen. You wanted a bad vlog, you got it. Dartford have just lost 2-1, it's full time. Uh, probably didn't deserve to lose. I think a draw would have actually, ge I mean I mean it genuinely, not a, not a biased view. I think a draw would have been a fair result. That is absolutely gutting. We're slipping so close to the relegation zone. It's absolutely unreal. Um, but look, it's another loss. Uh, we got to go again at Bath next week. James, thoughts? Yeah, same as you, mate. Didn't deserve to lose, definitely. Um, but didn't, didn't deserve to win. Didn't do enough to win at all. Um, I can't remember, really, other than the goal, we didn't have another chance in the second half. So, yeah. But Farnborough, definitely better second half. And to be honest, I'm going to Bath expecting to lose as well. Well, so. I hate to say it, but going to Bath expecting to lose. But see you next week on the vlog where I'll say 4 0 Dartford. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> look. Too much belief. Um, with very little results. Uh, go home now, uh, rest up, try not think about that result too much, but uh, look, it's, it's a gutting day, it's yet again another loss, we're just, it's, yeah, it's, it's uh, no words, no words, no words. It's just shit. Yeah, thank you, that's it, that's it. So, look, see you next week for another Dartford vlog. And hopefully, even a point away would be nice. Till the next one, thank you as always for watching. See you later. Bye.